Hello, my name is Anne and I'm going to show you how to open multiple PDF documents from a Craft CD in your disk drive with Craft Artist 2 and then how to copy and paste the contents into a new project with a view to making a new digit kit with the elements. So to start I'm going to click on File and Open. Now down here on the bottom right it's actually just saying craft artist, craft artist project. I'm going to change that to PDF files. So it will look for PDF files on the uh, disk drive that we're going to find now. I'm going to click on computer. And there's my disk drive there where I know my craft CD is. I'm going to double click on that. And I know that my PDF files are in this folder here. Double click on that and there they all are. Now you could open all of them by selecting them all at once like this. Just dragging and selecting them all, highlighting them all. Or what I'm going to do is just select three of the files by holding down CTRL on my keyboard and then just pick the three that I want which are those. They're highlighted and there's the names of the files down there and go click open. All depending how many files you select and how big the files are it might take a little while for them to actually show in Craft Artist and they will all come up as separate tabs. There's one, two and three. Next thing I'm going to do is add a new craft project by going to File, New, New Craft Project, and there's the new tab for that. And down here at the bottom, I'm going to add another two pages insert page, insert page. And now I have three blank pages that I can copy and paste onto from the three PDF files that I've opened. So starting with the first one, click on the tab. Now if there was just one element on the page, I could highlight, click on it to uh, select it. Right click, copy and then paste into my new craft project. But because there's quite a few on there, I'm actually going to do it a different way by going to edit and select all. And that's exactly what it's done. Then I'm going to right click and copy. Then I'm going to click on my new craft project tab, right click and paste. And that's the first one done. Let's get a new page ready on that new craft project. Go to the second of our PDF files, click on the tab, go to edit, select all, right click, copy, open up my new craft project, right click and paste. Get the first page ready on this new craft project. Go to the third of the PDF files, edit, select all, right click, copy into the new craft project, right click and paste. And there we have all the elements in one project ready to make a digikit. And it's just a question of selecting them bit by bit and putting them into the tabs on the left. So that one I'm going to make into material. And then these are going to be elements. And you just do that with each of the pages with the, uh, the new saved elements on, bit by bit. And then you can go into your DigiKit Creator by going to Tools, DigiKit Creator. And whatever you've put into the tabs on the left will show in the Digi DigiKit Creator pane. And then you can save DigiKit, give it a name, and you have your new elements to use in a pack file that will um, open 
when you go into your Digikit browser. Thank you for looking.